Make a date with Reverend Dr. Ebenezer Markwe at 6 a.m. from Monday to Saturday on Graphic Online via Facebook and YouTube as he expounds on matters of faith. Graphic Online, truth and accuracy every day. Hello, this is Reverend Dr. Ebenezer Markwe of Living Streams International, bringing you Matters of Faith with Graphic Online. And this morning, I'm still in the role of Transfiguration Anecdotes. And I like to call this, this um, one Lessons from the Papas. Lessons from the Papas, as in P-A-P-A-S, Papas, the fathers, the daddies. Lessons from them. Now, the Bible said when Elijah and Moses met Jesus on the Mount of Transfiguration, they, they, there were revelations they were bringing him. There were lessons they were bringing him. There was information they were bringing him. So you know what? Your mountaintop experiences, there are information, there is information in it. Don't just celebrate the ambience of your mountaintop experience and neglect the information. You know, most of the time, we always talk about, you know, and, and then, you know, at the Mount of Transfiguration, Jesus changes, clothes change, and all those other things. These are just peripherals. These are things that, that come as a bonus. The main ingredient of that, why would Elijah come? Why would this thing come? Just to change his clothes or to change his countenance? It's more than that. There is information they are bringing, and that information they are bringing is very simple. The Bible says they came to talk to him about his disease. That means there were lessons they were bringing to him. There were message, the message. They came to the crux, the most important thing. It is, it is not the, just the power of the revelation, but it is the purpose. It's not the power of the experience, but it's also the purpose of the experience. It's not the, it's not the manifestation of the experience. It is the information of the experience. So Peter catches a great draught of fish, and as he said, I will make you a fisher of men. So there's information in it. Now, now Saul, um, uh, Saul, or, 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 or David is anointed. That's a powerful experience. David is anointed, but the anointed is for something. So don't just enjoy the power, the ambience of the power, and neglect the message in the power. So Peter uh, uh, just opens his mouth, and, and then, but there's something. Elijah and Elisha came to give Jesus an information. They came to. To, 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 to give him some, some, some message. And, and, and the message is very simple. They came to talk to him about his disease, his death. Why, why the two people? Why the two people? We'll see this in the last uh, bit of a transformational, uh, transfiguration anecdotes, part, part seven. And we're, we're, going, to, we're going to deal into that. But till then, hey, see you later.